Gator 99.5, today's country hits also at Gator99.5.com. Good morning. Here it is on the 6th day of August 2014. I'm Chris St. James. Scott Lewis is going to be out for the next uh, two weeks. He's actually having his tonsils removed as we speak. Yeah, he actually called me early this morning and said, Hey, man, good morning. You suck. I'm like, well, I'm glad you're in a good mood. <laughs> anyway, he's out for the next two weeks. So I have been a busy little bee. What I've been doing is actually getting uh, various celebrity co-hosts for the next two weeks. And I'll tell you what, we we start off old school. What I have, some graduates from Sam Houston High School, 1994. Okay, I know you as Jonathan Jibney, but you said you want to go by Johnny Collins today? Don't start. Don't start. And also we've got we've got uh, Julie Johnson Kurtz. Yes. Okay. Good. 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 I know you got married, and uh, so how, how's it going, guys? It's going great. Good. Thanks good, for good, good, having good. us. Awesome. Yeah. Good to be here. And uh, oh my goodness, we are like loaded with yearbooks, lots of history, a lot of memories and stuff. Wow. You believe it's been more than twenty years now since we've graduated Sam Houston High School? It's crazy. Wow. It feels like yesterday all at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey guys, what y'all been up to? I got married a couple years ago. Yeah, I yeah. teach in Moss Bluff at Kids Place. Yeah. It's awesome. Good life. We just moved. It's awesome. Cool, cool, cool. And Jonathan? Yeah, I'm in management at Grand Rental Station, small equipment rental company here in Lake Charles. Right. Whatever. Never left the area. I guess I'm a little bit of a homeboy. Homeboy. <laughs> You're a homeboy. He's here in Lake Charles now. And I'll oh, tell you what. Cool. So, you know, memories galore. What would be the one or two memories? Now, I know Julie and I, we actually go back to Lost Bluff Elementary School. You joined in, was it the fifth grade year? Yes, sir. Cool. cool. Oh, don't address me, yes, sir. <laughs> I'm only a year <laughs> older than you, Jonathan. <laughs> so tell me a little bit, what memory stands out the most when it comes to uh, school? If there was one or two. Yeah, a uh, rude awakening I got when I moved to Moss Bluff. A uh, good pal of mine now, uh, Matt Sonye, about the third day of school, I wasn't quite accepted yet. I guess I had to be initiated. So Matt, Matt promptly shut me down, and uh, I guess I was flirting with a girl he liked or something. So oh, he, he no. pushed me face first in the dirt <laughs> at recess on about my third day at no. Moss Bluff, and it was just all downhill after that. <laughs> you, Jules? I can get in touch with them if you need me to. Oh, no, no, that's 20, not the, okay. 35 years later. Yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> just like, okay, are you okay now? How about you, Julie? Um, I was I was going through my brain trying to see what was a really funny story. Yeah. And I picked the most embarrassing story. We were at Sam Houston, and I was coming down the outside back stairs, and I missed the very last step with a load full of books. And Stephanie Church was standing there with me, and we both fell because, of course, I grabbed her to catch myself and she grabbed somebody else. Yeah. It was, I hit the ground, we both laughed, and three teachers came up and that was my, that was my freshman year, my induction into high school. Oh, I'm sure my sister my loved that. <laughs> now, I, I'm to let this uh, out. Uh, Miss Lulla, she used to teach math mm -hmm. at the middle school. Uh, there was no relation. Right. That, that was a lie. Yeah. <laughs> that was an absolute yeah. lie those years. Our, our first indication was when you failed the class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, she was tough. <laughs> I didn't even have her. Oh my goodness. You know what, guys? It just seems like it's just been so long ago. We've got yearbooks, yearbooks. Let's take a look and see how we've changed in these years. Actually, we're going to go back actually further than 20 years. My eighth grade year. Oh my gosh, let me see, where's that hair here? Where's your most dependable? Oh, great. Remember this cat? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, Andre Agassi up, up. there, huh? Right there. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> oh, this kid's missing a cigar. <laughs> <sighs> Let's see, that's fine. This would be what? Junior year now? Oh what year? Shall we find uh Miss Julie? <laughs> she got the whole world in her this hands. Would be Julie, John, Johnson. <laughs> wow. She's global. So is my hair. So is hair. Yeah. <laughs> that was cool back then. That was a cool hairstyle. Everybody had a perm, right? That was a stock? Yeah, it was the I didn't have a perm. Do they even sell perms anymore? I've seen ads for perms. Oh. I'm just not sure. Uh, it was cool. Where is... 
should have been. He had those cool glasses too. In all fairness, Chris did clean up. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. yeah. Look at the rat's nest I have on my head. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. Let's see, where is... What is 88? Sixth grade. Hey, the king of the schmirk. No. It's Jonathan Gibney. Yeah. <laughs> 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 all right. Those were the days. Seventh grade, let's see. 